Hey guys, and welcome back to Skies of Arcadia. Let's go back to our home island. Uh, now we've recovered Fina's ship, and we've hopefully finally sent um, our friend D Loco to the bottom. Oh, hello. <clears throat> Black Pirate. Oh, Bolter's ship. Really? What does he want? Captain Bolter, there's a really powerful looking ship coming our way off the port side. It's the ship that everyone's talking about, Delphinus, the one that the Blue Rogue Vase commands. Yeah, so Vase, we meet again. This time I have a little something special for you. Alright men, on the pride of the Black Pirates, kill them all. Really? Uh, good luck. Vase, Black Pirates, dead ahead. But wait, hey, isn't that Baltimore's ship? Yeah, it looks like they've done a little work on their own ship as well. Let's test out their new defenses for them. Okay. Cool. I guess. More ship combat. <clears throat> Excellent. That is a cool looking ship, to be fair. Yeah! How do you like the power of the new improved Blackbeard? This ship is equipped with nothing but the best stuff that stolen money can buy. This is the ultimate black pirate ship. <laughs> uh, yeah, well. That's cool, buddy. Sure. Um, sure. Let's see what our ship does to his. Really? Really? We, we, we won... Okay. Get out of here, you bum. Severical figure. Timing valve. Hybrid wax. Nice. Literally one shot, dude. One shot. Curse you, Vase. How could you defeat me again? The next time we meet, I'll defeat you. You will rue the day you cross... Baltor. Good job, Faze. Seriously, that fool doesn't know when to give up. But at least he's not a quitter. Not only do you have the Armada chasing you, Faze, the Black Pirates are after you as well. You're quite popular. <laughs> this isn't the kind of popularity that I need. Well, I'm glad my last battle on the Delphinus was a victorious one. Enrique? <laughs> I'm sorry. Alright, Sailor's Island should be coming up soon, Vase. Let's go. Well, kill them all, eh? Hard to say that when your skin's boiling off your body. Right, now, let's, uh, present island. Yes, yes, okay. Right, let's keep down below. Full speed, please. No half measures here. Right. How about now? There we go. We should be able to surface somewhere about now. There we go. Look at that. Out of the clouds. Okay. Phase, do not return to Crescent Island. I beg of you. If I go back now, I'm afraid that my... Determination will falter. I cannot allow myself to do that. Oh, right. We need to go to Sailor's Island. Oh, my bad. My bad, dog. My bad. I'm sorry. <clears throat> right. Okay, sure. Sailor's Island, I guess. Ugh. You know, this isn't really a taxi. I'm just saying. Alright, well, I suppose at the end of the day, this is your ship. Suppose. Kind of. Maybe. Question is, could you take it back? I don't think so. Enrique, are you really going? I am the Prince of Valua. I must return home to warn everybody of Gaussian's plans. 
Gregorio is willing to give his life for what he believed in, then I must do the same. You, all of you, you taught me so much about ships, about the sky, about what it means to fly and fight, I think I said. And you taught me that there are all kinds of people in this world, people worth fighting for, people worth dying for. I want to protect them, all of them. I want to build a country where the people don't have to live in fear. Please forgive me for leaving your side, but I've got to save Valua. <clears throat> Ooh, what should we say here? Um, so be careful. Can't you? Oh, can't you think this is? Oh, think this over. I guess we could say. Don't get air sick, okay? Or be careful, maybe? There we go. Be careful out there. You better come back and visit us at Crescent Isle someday. I'm sure he will. Sure, I'll be back to see you. And for Princess uh, Mogi. Oh, I've no doubt about that. <clears throat> Enrique, be careful. So there's only three of us now. If you don't come back and visit us, I'm coming after you. Thank you, everybody. I'll never forget our travels together. Well, let's hope not. Right, well, there goes the prince. Enrique has left the party. That's unfortunate. Godspeed, friend. Godspeed. Ah, uh, should we have a quick squiz around here? See if there's anything new? Well, I'm pretty sure, like, the X cannon's the best gun. That we can get sky battle king so we are still sky battle king excellent a title absolutely fitting us triple turbo uh, well we don't need too many but we don't need twin turbos we've got a triple turbo yeah i mean that's kind of ridiculous triple turbo but whatever uh okay, so what else do we have? Ivy Band, protects against poison, counter bracer. Ugh, not really worth it, is it? Uh we did have something. Charm we don't need well we do need those, but not yet. Gruel. Uh magic note. We did find a load of Glyph of Speed Cure healing save or of valor we've got one of those sacra crystal what am i looking for here what did we find crystalline box we don't need these boxes do we I'm never going to use them okay that's not what i'm looking for there i guess uh all that what did we find? Everlasting. Didn't we get a load of like something cool? <clears throat> uh, no, maybe not. All right, fair. I thought we found a load of something under underground. So we got the Pyre Cannon. Nah. Yep. Compound. Ooh, no. Uh, the timing valve. Yeah. Nope, nothing good there. Okay. See you later, dude. Hopefully the prince isn't barfing his guts up as we speak. Oh, I wonder if that dude's got anything new to say. We're going to have a chat with him in a second. Now, potentially, we are going to go get a new weapon soon. Right, let's buy. Uh... Ooh. No. Nope. Nothing but trash. All trash. Got anything good to say, though? Most weapons are made... Oh, yeah. You're just going to regurgitate the same old bullshit we've already heard. Yeah. I'm sure we'll come again. Uh, maybe. Probably not. What have you got to say, dude? A former black pirate has opened a rest... Yeah, we know. We know. 
God. I thought we got some interesting news in this place. Uh, uh, does this guy have anything to say? Now we've like basically defeated everybody. Ah, oh, yeah, no, we haven't done Lord. Yeah, we haven't done him. <clears throat> okay, interesting. And there's still yeah nothing here. Cool. Right. See you later. Okay, so now we can go back home. Back home it be. Return to our ship. Well, let's go. Probably could have saved it. Well then, should we head back to Crescent Island and get Fina's ship ready? Enrique left us, and once we get back to Crescent Island, Fina will leave us too. Kind of makes me not want to go home. <laughs> what are we talking about? I'm sorry, Fina. I, uh, I will miss you too. This is the first time in my life that I haven't been excited about sailing somewhere. <sighs> yeah, well, heavy times indeed, but all good times must come to an end. <clears throat> oh, right, we just appear back there. Cool. Home sweet home. Hey, looks like they made it back alive after all. Hey, Gilda's... Oh, Gilda's back. Cool. Ica, Fina, long time no see. Hi, Vase. You all look well. Gilda, Clara, it's great to see you too. What's in the basket? I just baked a bunch of pies. Oh, dude. Come on, let's eat whilst they're still warm. Uh, yeah. Hell yeah. Wow, really? Homemade pies? Clara, you're the best. I'm glad you all made it back safely. And it looks like you've got Fina's ship back. Does that mean she'll be returning to the Great Silver Shrine soon? Yes, thank you, Gilda, for all you've done for me. <laughs> you don't have to thank me. You guys did all the hard stuff. Well, Fina, looks like you've completed your mission. You're going home a hero. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Aw, oh, she looks so happy there. Well, since you're leaving us, we should throw you a going away party. Let's hear it for Fina. Awfully peaceful. Oh, excuse me. <coughs> Ta-da! Feast your eyes on this. Dude, that looks awesome. Wow, it looks delicious. Clara, you're amazing. Well, Fina, it looks like this is going to be a great party. The size of that turkey or whatever it is. Yes, thank you, all of you. It means so much to me. I I started not knowing anything about this world. But thanks to all of you, I was, uh, I was one of the first to sail around it. I remember when you first got here. You didn't even know what it meant to buy stuff. What? What kind of crazy place is she from? I'm not lying. She said that they don't use gold at the Great Silver Shrine. Wow, that's odd. I don't know if you guys are really advanced or really behind. It's not just gold we don't have. Flowers, animals. There are so many things that I've never seen until I came here. In my travels with all of you, I've experienced so much. And one more thing. I learned something very important whilst I was here. When I left the shrine, the elders told me you cannot trust anybody in that world. They said that the people of this world were fools who just bickered amongst themselves and burned in the flames that they set themselves that they themselves set. But I met so many caring people whilst I was here. I learned that even though some try to obtain their objectives through war, there are others that work together to try and bring peace. I learned so much. The memories that we've shared will be the most valuable treasures I'll ever have. 
Aww. Well then, tonight we party until morning. <laughs> yeah, apparently so. Those bottles look good. Oh dear. <laughs> and so Fina's farewell party continued merrily until the morning. Food was shared, tales were told, and the bonds of friendship were strengthened. Aww. The first encounter with Fina, the great escape from Valua, the search for the moon crystals. God, we've come so far. Really does feel like an epic journey that we've come through. It's kind of cool. I kind of like playing this paced out like a few videos a week because even for me, it feels like a huge journey. As the memories resurfaced, it seemed as if there would be no end to the days they would spend traveling together. And then... Fina, what's wrong? Let's join in the fun. Yes. Tomorrow I'll have to leave. I'll be alone. Again. I don't want to leave. I want... I want to stay here with all of you. You all mean so much to me. Oh, Fina, um, I... Oh, hello. File... Nope, that's not fireworks. <clears throat> what was that? <laughs> Marco. Face, face! It's an emergency! It's the Amada! They're here! Oh dear, the Amada? Well, ready the Delphinus? Let's go send them to their graves. Oh dear. They've got like Delphinus class ships too. Well, this is bad. Blowing our little island to oh dear to pieces. No, it's all on fire. Face, look out! Oh god, we got little gobby shits. All right, let's go to work. Value and soldier. <laughs> A nice place you had here. Pity that it's burning to the ground. Um. We would have asked you to surrender, but we decided it would be more fun to kill you. Oh dear. Well, let's go. Time to fight. It's like we're gonna... We'll go for some Reign of Swords. Let's see how they like this. Let's go. I don't think you're gonna be leaving just yet, Fina. Just saying. Right, well, I'm sure that was just the first wave. Let's go. Value and scum. How did they find our base? If you must know. Oh, Sephiroth, is that you? Ramirez. A patrol ship spotted the Delphinus when you came to Dangurl, and they followed you back here. But I have no interest in you or any of your crew. There is another purpose for my visit. I am here for the crystals. Hand them over. Now. If you hand them over peacefully, I'll call off my troops. If not, we will bombard your pitiful island until you're all dead. Huh. <sighs> You'll have to kill us. I'll trade them for the lives of our crew. Mm. Did you think we'd just hand them over? You'll have to kill us. Nothing would make me happier. Now, you'll die. Ooh. Oh dear.
die. From what I remember, we actually can't defeat this guy. Let's just go for like Pirate's Wrath. Uh, I'm pretty sure we can't kill this guy. No, no. Look, I mean, look how much health he has. Ridiculous. Yeah, this guy is just insanely powerful. Yeah, there's no way. Alright, let's get this over with. His stats are just out of this world, I guess. Oh, you missed. Oh, sucks to be you, I guess. Well, these shadows aren't up to much. Let's try. You know what? Let's just go for Reign of Swords. That'll kill all of his dudes at least. I don't even think his health has like gone down. Oh, he... I don't know. Maybe we can kill this guy? Maybe? I kind of thought we couldn't. Maybe it's just like a hell of a fight. Ah, Silver Eclipse. <clears throat> Darkness. Uh, Sword of the Dark Moon. That's bad. I think he's just cut us all in half. Oh, maybe not. Okay. You know what? Let's go. Pirate's Wrath. Um, Delta Shield. Uh, oh no, we don't have Justice thing, do we? Uh, Lift of Might on base, I guess. Yeah, I was expecting that to do more. I really was. Ah, yeah, his health's not going down. There's no way. Perplexing. Ooh, that's bad. But, yeah, that's cool. Uh, yeah, he has, like, special move, I suppose. More Pirate's Wrath. I mean, we definitely want a mega shield here. Uh, might. Ugh, go on. Let's try this. this could be a long fight. Yeah, his health isn't actually going down, I don't think. Let's just die and see what happens. Yeah, his health hasn't gone down at all. Yeah. Um, I'm sure I remember we have to get killed here. I'm sure we do. Well, I mean, <laughs> there goes Ica. That's bad. Unfortunately, that is a very long special move. We kind of just have to sit through. Oh, oh, we could have done. A super move. Well, if we survive, we'll go and do a super move next time. Just for the fun. Well, I think Fina's about to die. Yeah, Fina's gone. Can we? Oh, we can do the blue rogues. Just for the lols. Oh, that's like the whole lot. Oh, yeah, I forgot. He throws like a huge luger at the guy. Even little pal gets involved. Good. Okay. Okay. Come on. This is like a six minute long fight, I forgot. Wow, that like did nothing. Okay. <laughs> yeah, we we haven't even moved the needle on his health. He really takes some time to kill you, doesn't he? I always think, you know, if you're going to be forced into a situation where you have to die, 
uh, in one of these games, they should just, you know, get it over with. Don't force you into a battle that you can't win. And there's the grand dick penis man taking all the crystals at last. All of the crystals are mine. Ramirez, wait. Why? Why are you doing this? Athena, the people of this world don't deserve to live. Like you, I was sent here to gather the crystals. Shortly after I arrived, I discovered the value and empire was also searching for them. They were relentless. I knew they would eventually find them. After value, after Valuer's forces retrieved the crystals, I was going to steal them and return to the shrine. Okay. While I was in the Valuer, I learned a great deal about the people of this world and what motivates them. Greed, hatred, bigotry. The only valuable, uh, the only valuable value material items. Let's start again. Greed, hatred, bigotry. They only value material items that can be bought with gold. The people of this world are shallow and petty. <clears throat> I lost all hope for them. Begin to despise these loathsome creatures. But there was one that was different from the rest. Lord Gaussian. Lord Gaussian was swayed by neither flattery nor gold. He also had little faith in the people of this world. Only one thing mattered to him. That was power. Lord Gaussian convinced me that this world needed a singular ruler. One that could slaughter the weak and lead the strong. He showed me the meaning of true power. The one that holds all the power can end lives, destroy cities, and change the world. A man like Gaussian needs to rule this world. Only he can unlock its potential. I swore an oath I would lay down my sword and my life for Lord Gaussian. We now hold all of the crystals. With these, a power greater than the Gigas will be brought back to this world. Now all of you will bow before him. Oof, you're a fool to underestimate us. Wait a minute, was that not... I'm sure that's what we're supposed to say. Oh, you're a fool to underestimate us. Do you think we'll just let you get away with this? Fools. What can you do without the moon crystals? You don't even know their true purpose. What are you talking about? The power to cool down the rains of destruction lies hidden within them. Fina, you knew that it was our people that cooled down the rains of destruction, did you not? What? That, that, that's a lie! We were not sent here to prevent the Gigas from being revived. We were sent here so the Elders could unearth the lost continent of Saltus. That is our true mission. Once the six moon crystals are combined, the lost continent will rise from the deep sky. But now, I work for Gaussian. Together we will raise the lost continent and with it unleash the reins of destruction ourselves. I don't know what you mean by Lost Continent, but we aren't you people. Uh, but aren't you people forgetting something? You only have five of the crystals. The battle isn't over until we have all six. <coughs> you are correct, but you don't know about the sixth crystal, the silver crystal. Watch closely. Uh. What? Wait. What the? In his hand? The silver crystal? Ah! Uh oh. Ica. Oh, Fina. Uh oh. And it's in her chest because of course it is. All Silvites are born with a piece of the silver crystal within them. 
In other words, the silver crystal contains our life force. Only through death can the crystal be retrieved from our bodies. Unlike uh, Theodora, we are not interested in Fina's knowledge of the ancients. We are interested in the crystal within her body. Fina, you shall give me the sixth crystal. Oh, so he can't use the one that's in himself. He's killing Fina. Fina! No! Come, Fina. Give your life to Lord Gaussian. Uh, how about no? Ooh, hello. Yeah, it's a good thing that guy's long-winded. <laughs> Hang on, we got you covered. Pests. Nevertheless, I got what I came for. I can get the silver crystal any time I please. Looks like somebody's running away. Fina! So how are they born with the crystal inside? Who knows? The crystals are ours. Farewell. Why don't you kill yourself to get the crystal? You'll pay for this, Ramirez. You will pay. Oh my. You gave the fine... You gave the five moon crystals to Ramirez. Yeah, that kind of sucks. But I guess what choice do we have? Jeez, look at this. Good thing we got two million gold in the bank. Base, just finished putting out the last fire. This is horrible. I know, everything that we've worked so hard for is gone. Our base is in ruins. And we lost all of the crystals. The Delphinus isn't powerful enough to invade Valua either. Uh, <laughs> if you say so. What are we supposed to do? Well, hmm. What should we do? I will not give up. I will not give up. Phase I. It's not going to be easy. But we can rebuild our base. As for the crystals, well, at least we know they're all in the same place. Don't give up, Ico. If we give up, then Ramirez will destroy the entire world. Yeah, no pressure. Uh, we have to keep fighting. There's always a way. <laughs> yeah. You're right. At one point, this was a deserted island. And you were stranded here all by yourself. Exactly. That reminds me. How is Fina? Well, uh, actually, ever since Ramirez left, she's been up in the meeting room by herself. I think everything that happened yesterday was a little too much for her, Vase. Why don't you try and talk to her? I can't imagine what she's going through. Yeah, I'll go talk to her. Right, and we will go talk to her, but before... Before we do anything, we're going to save the game. And that's it. And it's going to be five days until I get to see what happens next. You guys have to wait two days. Or one, really. I have to wait five days. <laughs> one of us gets a better deal than the others. Anyway, so thank you very much, guys. And as always, till next time.